guys, welcome back to another video by me, The Yellow Ninja, and today I'm going to do, be doing part one of four of the LEGO review series. Today I'm going to be reviewing the Ultra Stealth Raider from LEGO Ninjago. This is the first LEGO review, LEGO review that's not Harry Potter, so... Yeah, I thought it would be good, a good, um, review video. I'm only gonna be doing one vehicle and the minifigure for that, um, in a video. So today, I'm gonna be doing this lightning bike, and I'm gonna be reviewing Jay, the master of lightning. So let's get started with the review. Right, so... Here is the lightning bike, and here is the J minifigure. I'll be reviewing J later on in the video. So let's just set him, set him aside for right now, and let's look at the bike. So this bike is pretty cool. Um, on the back it has this big wheel with some kind of spinner blade thing, and it just it's attached to this piece, which is the one side of the bike and and it allows it to spin it's the same on the other side and it, it's pretty cool um down here there's this blue bullet piece for lightning that then attaches onto this blaster on the other side this can um fire you just push down. You just push down and then it just. So, up front, there are these two gold blade things. They can move around. And then uh, there's this, like, there's this thing up front, like um, a tread or something. And I can just. So that allows it to roll. And then up here, there's this lightning symbol, which is a printed tile. And then on this, there are these two clips where you can attach Jay's swords. And then there's a spot for, for Jay to sit. And then you can just sit on there. And then this piece is to attach onto the rest of the Ultra Stealth Raider, which I'll show you in a future video. And that's basically all for the bike, so let's get started with the J minifigure. Here's the minifigure. This is a very cool J minifigure. This is based off his of based off of his suit from Lego Ninjago Day of the Departed special. Um, it's like a new version of his very first outfit, which, and then he has his, like, air jitsu shoulder pad with a place for his swords, and then he has a second face, which is, like, this worried face, that's what it looks like, he has, like, this worried face, um, then he has this happy face. Or, like, a grinning face. He has his belt, or, like, strap thing that then continues down onto his leg print. And then there's, a, he has one silver arm, which is a part of his suit. And then one, like, dark blue or, like, a navy kind of color. He has his lightning symbol, which is, like, a lightning squid there on his print on his shirt and then on the back underneath the shoulder pad there this sack sacks whatever and then that's pretty much the main or that's pretty much the J mini figure here's just one final quick look at him
friends for watching this re Lego review. Remember, this is just part one of four. Next time, I will be reviewing this cockpit, like the main part for Cole, the Master Earth, which is possibly one of my favorite minifigures in the set. Besides Zane, he's my favorite. Um, and then... And then after I review all four of them, I'll be showing you this other vehicle with Master Chen. And I just make sure you follow or subscribe to my Twitch channel, VO Ninja 9, for some more um, content. And. If you do enjoy my Lego reviews or anything else, please, or I would recommend you like and subscribe to this channel. And, of course, this is just a makeup for the long wait between yesterday's video, or I don't know when this is coming out, but March 15th video on how to get Kabu cane. Link to that video in the description. And I'll see you guys all in the next video. See ya!